Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. And a warm welcome on what is a fine day for football. I'm delighted to be able to report. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And excited to be bringing you match day one action at the Euros. It's Germany versus Hungary. Well, these teams know they cannot afford to drop points today. It's so important they are consistent throughout the group stages if they want to progress further in the tournament. Should be tense, Derek. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Manuel Neuer begins in goal. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Jonathan Tarr in central defence. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And here's the 11 for Hungary. Well, it looks like they're going to play in a 3-4-3 formation without wing-backs, which means the outside centre-halves will need to cover the areas out wide, which I would say is asking a lot. And the game begins. Andri. So Germany get the tournament underway on home soil. Scotland their first opponents, then Hungary and Switzerland. And Julian Nagelsmann, this young tactical innovator, is the man Germany are pinning their hopes on, Stuart. Well, he is, but he's got a very difficult job at the moment because Germany haven't played well in the run-up to this tournament. They haven't played well for quite some while, but they have a great record. I go right back to 1972 when they beat the Soviet Union in Brussels. A great tournament, great teams. Can they do it this time? They've got the home support. I'm not sure they're good enough, though. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent, so what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, we know he's a top-class player, but at set plays, that's where he's at his very best. And he's got so many techniques, he can hit through the back of the ball, he can wrap his foot round it, or just chip it over the wall. He'll certainly score goals if given the chance today. Gundogan and Havertz well oh, fine play and maybe it'll set something up the save was a good one <laughs> favouring the short one that's not a bad ball. Oh, disappointing clearance. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Varga. Barnabas Varga. Schaefer. Well, Hungary seeding possession.
And they're not standing off their opponents in the slightest. Shalai. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Roland Shalai. Bendegus Bola. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Horse making quite a bit of progress. Giving it a try. The first goal always important, and it comes in this game from Tony Kroos. Yeah, here's the setup play. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? And then Kroos finishes it brilliantly. He strikes the ball cleanly and gives the goalkeeper absolutely no time to react. It's a really good goal. One nil then. Kepkez. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. And that's an important intervention. So Bosloy. Who can he pick out? Well, space if he goes inside. Now breaking at pace, potential danger. All at all, a broken counter attack. in the middle cuts it back and hit with ferocity it was close but not quite good enough Good bit of closing down. Andy. It's with Gundogan. Gundogan. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Crucial piece of defending. Oh, offside. How marginal was that? But the flag is raised. Andras Schaefer. So Bosloy. Moving the ball nicely in search of an equaliser. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Driven in the corner. In the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. And over the touchline for what will be a hungry throw. Bola. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. Really favours this position. Oh, how about that for a tackle? Andrich. 
It's with Gundogan. Can he finish this? Oh, tremendous reflex action there from the keeper. Well, he didn't have long to react, did he? But that's a top-class save, I have to say. So, Bosloy. And he's made headway. And the keeper to the rescue. Well, he takes some beating, that's for sure. It really is a top class save. Keen to take it short here. Huge block. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? And a goal! They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, he hasn't quite had the impact on attack that we were expecting, Stuart. Well, as you can see, he just hasn't had enough touches in the key areas. And that's one of the reasons they're losing this game at the moment. So, off and running again here. Germany dominating the proceedings. A breathtaking first half showing. Will they be able to match that in the second? And a timely intervention. Difficult to stop him. Adam Nudge. Now the attack fizzled out. This looks promising. Cutting the ball back. Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, it wasn't first-class distribution. Havertz. Now the counter-attack looks on. All in all, a broken counter-attack. So, Bosloy. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. Getting in there to intercept. Jamal Musiala. Now can they make something happen? And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. Well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw-in to come. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here.
It is a decent looking attack here. And the keeper more than equal to it. And the substitution will occur now. And over comes the corner. Well, sadly, too straight to worry the goalkeeper that time. Keeper not concentrating. Orban. Adam Nudge. Plenty of support here. Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, the danger is still there. Kleinheisler. A very timely interception. Havertz. This is Kroos. Well, this could really help the cause. And the keeper more than equal to the task. So a personnel change then. take it short just the challenge that was required Adam well maybe a good position from which to counter well they promised much on the break but ultimately delivered little Vietz Havertz. Oh, fine stop. And they're making a change. And deciding to go short with this one. Nicely timed tackle. Adam Nudge moving forward effectively and he's kept it out fully stretched somehow reaching it it's a short corner and a throw in for Hungary. Wirtz. And a good looking ball. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And so into the final five minutes. Adam Nudge. Vili Orban. Milos Kerkes. Adam Nudge. Oh, commanding goalkeeping.
And over it comes. Not away completely. Great defending. So two minutes to be added on at the end. Thomas Müller. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Couldn't get it through. And making headway. Andri. Constantly thwarted. Well, the referee was of a mind to see whether anything would come of that, but now he's going to hand out the caution. And he was never going to get away with that one. It's really good refereeing. Corner played into the box. Well, able to. And the final whistle, the big story here Germany have prevailed. Stuart, your analysis. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Well, it just seems that this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him.